Minimum wage in Ohio now stands at $10.10 an hour. Even with an increase at the start of the year, some experts say it's still not enough to get by. Michael Sandlin is live tonight. Mike, some may be surprised to find out how many people are working for minimum wage in our area. Yeah, that's right, Melissa. CEO Wendy Peastrew says based on their research, many single people and families alike here in Toledo rely on minimum wage to get by. And they say that that minimum wage is so low when it comes to income, those people are living below the poverty line. In fact, according to Peace True, here in Lucas County, 44% of the population fall into the ALICE bracket, which stands for Asset Limited, Income Constrained, and Employed. People in that category struggle to keep up with the cost of living, rising grocery prices, and other basic essentials, especially as people still grapple with inflation. Peace True says here in Toledo, a livable wage for one person starts around $15 to $18 an hour. And for families, that number is even higher. But Peace True says many Glass City households are making up to 38% less than that, often relying on minimum wage, and living at that income level is a daily struggle. You start thinking about your grocery cart, your electric, you know, your electric bills, your, you know, as, as rent has gone up, everything else. It, it starts to get very difficult throw in and needing to get your car fixed or, you know, uh, a medicine for a child. I mean, there are so many things that we find that the, those curveballs, especially that really create a cascade of instability for our families. Peace True says if you're struggling financially, you can call the United Way at 211. They have resources available to help you out and they're offering tax assistance until April. Reporting in East Toledo, I'm Michael Sandlin, WTOL 11.